The seventh step in the Neuroplasticity Super Protocol is to limit your learning sessions to 90 minutes or less. All humans operate on what are called ultradian cycles. These ultradian cycles are 90 minute cycles that happen throughout the day and throughout sleep. So when you go to sleep at night, you actually have 90 minute bouts of sleep that are very different from one another. As you transition through the night, your sleep is very different actually at the beginning of the night than it is at the end of the night. Now throughout the day, you're also in these so-called ultradian cycles. Every 90 minutes or so, your brain switches its overall state of alertness. Sometimes subtly so and you don't notice, but other times it's really apparent. If you want to learn, you need to limit those learning bouts to 90 minutes, one of these ultradian cycles. The reason for that is if you decide that you're going to focus and you're going to be alert and you're going to generate repetitions, you're going to put in these little gaps that are so important for learning. It's very hard to maintain that for longer than 90 minutes. It's kind of metabolically and mentally demanding. So for some of you, 10 minutes will be enough. For some of you, 20 minutes will be enough. But what you'll notice is that over time, you'll be able to focus and remain alert and remain in the process of learning for longer and longer. But I don't want anyone to try and learn anything for longer than 90 minutes. In fact, if you do one of these 90 minute learning bouts, even if you have the temptation to continue for another hour or so, it's important that you stop. And that if you're going to do multiple 90 minute learning bouts per day, that you separate them by at least an hour and probably two or three hours. Because what you're doing in this case is you're triggering a lot of neuroplasticity. But as you'll soon learn, the second part of neuroplasticity, the actual rewiring of the nerve connections that consolidates the learning and makes what you've learned easy and reflexive in the future, that requires that you not do so much triggering of learning that you can't access the states of mind that allow those neural connections to change. So 90 minutes or less is the appropriate amount of time for a learning bout.